talking about giving our dying to self and giving ourselves to the Lord is this process of sanctification is not come on you just church you're not just going to get there overnight come on still get there how often times in the course of our Christian existence we feel like Lord I just fail you and don't look like I'm getting any better Oh, yeah. huh. And we say, but Lord, please give me strength not to mess up and and you mess up seven ways past Sunday. I mess up right Come on now, you mess up. Amen. Church, it is a process. And and what do we, we die what? Amen. So when you mess up, you go to God and say, Lord, forgive me. And what does God do? Forgive you. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Praise the Lord. You ought to stop and give God some praise. Yes, <laughs> Amen. 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 So this is not giving you a license to sin. Uh -huh. It's just dealing with the real. Yeah. Amen. But now, so 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 we have we go through this process of sanctification, dying to self, dying to that. We become the antithesis of Invictus. Invictus is not the poem of our life. It is the poem of, of, of the sinner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. For my, co my soul is conquerable. God has conquered my soul. God did. Amen. Amen. And I am not the captain of my fate. I am not the master of my soul. God is. Amen. Right? Thank God. Amen. So, so, so God wants us to gather up the fragments of our time, our talent. He wants us to gather up the fragments of our treasure. Get, gather it up, because too often times we just we got too much stuff scattered abroad. Amen. And. And, 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 and really now said, Lord, give me grace now to gather up the fragments. So that the baskets, be, when we stored it out, all we had was five barley loaves. Lord, all I did was put it in your hand. Now we got five, 12 baskets full. Everybody is full. All I did was put it in Jesus' hand. Now I have more than sufficiency. All he did was bless it. And now I have more than sufficiency. Gather up the fragments that none be lost. There is a gathering time now. And this is, you know, it's part of the push initiative. Push because there are some things that are fragmented. First and foremost, before we can help anybody, we've got to help ourselves. That's right. Yeah. Amen. Oh. Amen. We've got to be all, come on, as you said before, all what? All in. Amen. And, and and let me make sure that we understand that word all in. And and, and, and this, you know, too often time I, I hope I don't sound like I'm playing, uh, and but 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 there's a sense of, of of you know funny and levity to the realism that I you know, I just that's just me. I just yeah. Amen. I just I you know, I, I ain't no sour puss. I ain't, Hallelujah. You got to have fun. You got to have fun. You got to have fun. Amen. Now, what is the first letter in the Bible? I. And the last letter in the Bible? I think B. I N. We are all in. Amen. Yeah, amen. I'm talking about from the I in Genesis to the in in amen in Revelation. We've got to be all in the Word. Amen. Eight, oh, see this. <laughs> we got to be all in the Word. Amen. The first letter in Genesis is I. I. And the last one. And the last letter in Revelation is N. Yeah. Huh? Hallelujah. All in. You got to be all in. Amen. In the Word. From Genesis, from the I in Genesis to the end in Revelation, we got to get, come on, somebody. Amen. Yes, sir, Brother Rob. Um, uh, I mean, you know I, I, you know, because I've been studying a lot you know, mm -hmm. in, in the Bible, and we just get back in, in my studies, right? Because I can understand what he's saying now. Mm -hmm. But 
I would say, okay, I would just automatically turn it into New Testament. Mm -hmm. and, and, and I put the Old Testament back. Mm -hmm. Now, uh-uh. No. Oh, now no. he got me going backwards. Me. Got me going backwards because it, me. he says, it's not a half a book. It's not a half no. a book. No, 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 no. No, no. This is a whole book. It's a this whole book. All of his words. Amen. You can't, if, we, if going, they take half the word, you might as well be a mourner. Huh. Or you might Amen. as well be a Jehovah's Witness. Amen. And only believe part of the word. Mm hmm. Take the whole You can't word. be like that. You, it's the ah. whole word of God. Ah, God. Amen. He tell me, no, no, no. You got to go backwards now. Amen. And so, you know, I find myself you converting go. in the verses here. Uh -huh. And then I got to read in my concordance, and boom, I got to go back. I got a and message it, for you to preach. Oh, he got, I got something there. I got a message got for you to preach. Going forward by going back. Hallelujah. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. Going backwards to move forward. Amen. Because I was just always grabbing just the New Testament, New Testament, ain't it, you know? And and now, it's, no, no, no. Yeah. You need to read the whole word. Mm -hmm. You can't just read half the word to keep you live your life. Amen. Because your answers are through with through the whole. It's through the whole. whole book. Amen. Amen. So we need we, we need all of them from Genesis through Revelation. Church, we need to study Genesis. We need to know uh, Exodus. We need to know. We ought to have somebody in here who are Deuteronomologists. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you know what you're saying? What in the world is a Deuteronomologist? <laughs> Did you say, do so you want to know what Deuteronomy is? <laughs> yes, the book of Deuteronomy. The book of Deuteronomy in the Old Testament. Yeah. We need somebody here who is so knowledgeable about the book of Deuteronomy that they can come in and give you revelations about revelation from the book of Deuteronomy. Yeah. They can yeah. preach Jesus from the book of Deuteronomy. Uh, Jesus That's is in Job, too. Jesus is in Job. Yeah. He's in every book. Yeah. He's in every book. Yeah. Yeah. In Esther. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. In every book. Yeah. It's time to come. Come on. We got two minute we, we we got two minute fragments scattered throughout the old. You need to gather up the fragments. Hallelujah. Let nothing be lost. Yes, ma'am, yeah. Sister Lee. Well, uh, in the book of John, Jesus said that um, uh, most the, the first five books in the Old Testament, mm -hmm. uh, he, uh, Moses wrote about him. Yeah, it's all about him. Mm -hmm. Amen. The book of Isaiah, oh, yeah. the book of Jeremiah, oh. mm -hmm. it's all about um, testimony. I mean, you know, it's about Jesus Christ, the coming of the Messiah. Coming. Right. So if you cannot connect the coming of the Messiah to Jesus Christ. Oh, you missing the whole? Oh, you missing parts of years before you were no, born? You missing the whole yeah. mess? The whole yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the whole mess. Years. Because the early dis the other apostles did not have the New Testament. Yeah. Right. They were at that time they were writing the New Testament. All they had was the Old Testament, yeah. and they preached Jesus Christ and Him crucified, sure. resurrected from the Old Testament. They didn't, there was no fragmentation. Isaiah, ah, they preached Jesus from Job, from Isaiah, from yeah. Jeremiah, from Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges. Yeah. Amen. They preached Jesus. So we need to be all in. Yeah. But come on now. Too often time we are too fragmented because law and order is on. We're too fragmented. Oh, he take them idols. Mm. Because, because something is home. We're too fragmented because if law and order is not on, I got something else on my mind. Something that shouldn't be on my mind. I'm worried. I got fears. I got threats. I got concerns. And the only thing that should be on our mind is one thing. You are here for business. That's the Father's business. Sometimes he's got to take certain things from us because <laughs> we've been holding on to something. Have you ever heard about that monkey? They put a peanut in a Coca-Cola bottle. 
And that monkey stuck his hand in there, grabbed that peanut, and died.